Hey, welcome to Grok Trade. My name's Des, and it is Friday, May 27, 2011. This is the fourth time I did this video, so I'm going to make this extremely fast to get it out the door. You know, I have my coffee. I don't know what my dill is. Usually I can do these in one take, but <laughs> we have the um, broad markets up virtually 0.2. Zero across the board, so we have some nice bullish activity. We did have April consumer spending showing a weak gain, and we had this big falling wedge on the S&P 60 minute. Big falling wedge. We did break out to the upside. Now we have an inverted head and shoulders, and we had this gap to fill. We filled this, and now going higher than than that gap. That is very bullish, and we're starting to break over these moving averages. Where we just have the 200 intraday moving average to clear, and there is one area that I'm concerned with. If I show this to you, swing high to swing high, swing low to swing low, you have a rising wedge. Those are more bearish than bullish. And if this thing does break down, it wouldn't surprise me if we just stay chopping around these moving averages because we're going into a long weekend, Memorial Day weekend. People will want to be flat this environment. So this, I'm expecting um, semi light to medium volume today, and um, and very little volatility. Doesn't mean it can't do that, but that's what I'm expecting. I'm expected to do very little trading today myself. But here are the resistance levels, and I have massaged some of these numbers, but not many of them. And here are support levels. And there you have it. Take care and safe trading. <laughs> Got this one done in fifth take. <laughs>